Hey guys, okay, today is July 6th, 2011, and it's Wednesday, and I'm back. <laughs> um, yesterday was my one week post op, and I went to surgeons, and <sighs> he said that I'm doing great. I started soft food supposedly yesterday, and so I'm on stage two. Um, I try to have a soup without straining it and I was not happy. I was miserable the rest of the night. Um, this morning I woke up with a lot of pain in my stomach because like I, I don't know, I don't know what happened, but anyway, that was not a good soup to eat. I guess the noodles were just not even greatly chewable, I guess. So my fault. I didn't have, I didn't finish it, like I had two little like spoonfuls and the, my daughter finished, well she ate it and I just had the broth. But it was still, like I was just miserable, I was not happy, I was upset, I was just, ugh. I was sick. <clears throat> Alright, well, let's see what else can I tell you. Let's do numbers. So I started off at my highest, 308.3, um, pre-op. That was before liquid diet. So on surgery day after liquid diet, obviously I was at 288.8. .8. And as of yesterday, which is going to be my weigh-in day on Tuesdays, I was at 286.4. So that's a 2.4 pound loss, which I guess is not great because everybody loses a lot more. You know, um, their first week, but that's okay because it's still lost, you know. And I know it's not like I cheated. It's not like I went and binged on some chicken broth, <laughs> which is like all I had. Let's binge on some chicken broth and Jello. <laughs> anyway, that's all. Um. So, I don't know. I just, I couldn't get enough in and I couldn't even get enough water. So, I'm guessing that has a lot to do with it. I'm not worried about it. I just, I'm right now, I'm just worried about, you know, being able to heal soon enough to get to the gym. Be able to, to work out now and, you know, not feel the discomfort in my shoulder either. Okay. Well, that's that. My week was okay. Um, I didn't really feel hungry. I had a really hard time eating, and cravings weren't even as bad as I thought they would be. Um, I just had more discomfort than anything. So I was happy that about that. Just uh, on Saturday, I guess I did start feeling a little like, ah, because it was my boyfriend and his family, like they were having a barbecue at my house, and I was like helping make the food. And all the salsas, yum. And all the guacamole. <laughs> but I, and then not being, being able to taste it, so whatever. It was okay. I mean, like, you know, not not doing it. I just felt like, I felt strong. <laughs> okay, whatever. I'm not trying to sound cocky, but, but it is what it is. <laughs> just kidding. Okay. So that's that. And then on Sunday... Uh, I went to work and that was so bad. I felt sick. I was miserable. I was dying. I literally wanted to cry. I had allergies and I kept sneezing and my stomach hurt intensely. My incisions were just like throbbing. And obviously I couldn't take Vicodin because I'm going to work. So that was bad. So anyway, alright. Um, on the 4th of July... I wasn't even craving so much the food that my boyfriend was eating or anything, but we went to the beach and him and my daughter got into the lake, so that's what I was craving, being able to go in the water with them, but I couldn't because my incisions, so that's it, but whatever. Um, non-scale victories, um, I guess people are kind of noticing my little weight loss I know it's only what I'm down a total of as of yesterday once again 21.2 pounds no 
21.5 or so? I don't know. I'll put it down here. Um, so anyway, like just in little things. Not, it's not obviously not my face, but like I guess my, my legs or something. Because I wear some boots that, um, usually, you know, and they, they're usually really snug on my legs and now I have to keep pulling them up. So that's kind of cool. Like, they're not completely falling, but they're, they're like, you know. <laughs> that was scary. <laughs> oh, that was scary. That scared me. Anyway. Yeah. So, that's that. And also the lady who might take my daughter to the daycare. She's like, yeah, you look slimmer. So I don't know how to take a compliment, I guess. Sorry I'm sounding so down. I'm just so sleepy. Um, okay, so today's been a good day because I said yesterday was my introduction to soft foods. Not a good night. But this morning I had a Shabani Greek yogurt. Oh my goodness, that is delish. You guys have to try those if you haven't. They are the best Greek yogurt that I have ever tried, ever. Mmm, but they're expensive. So anyway. Um, let's see. So, oh yeah, and for lunch I had some soup. It was like a creamy soup, so that went down well, and I only had a little bit of it. And I felt full, and I felt satisfied, and I still do. I've, ha I've gotten better today with water. I have already had a smart water bottle which is 33.8 ounces and a little bit more of a, a second one so I'm still working on that so before dinner I'll try to get some more in so I can just get at least my 64 ounces um, for the day um, so I'm like I said like I'm I don't know if I said it now or in the million other videos that I've made but I think that that's why I just didn't lose lots of weight. But yes, just because I couldn't get water in. But this time, like today, I can. So I'm feeling better. Today is a much better day. I think today has been the best day since surgery. So I feel good. Um, what else can I say? Um, I had so many things to say. I don't know when I can start working out. Um, because I forgot to ask my surgeon. Same thing happens. Like, I have a million questions to ask. And once he walks in the room, I space. And then when I have, when I'm making a video, I have a million and one things to say. And I space. So, whatever. Um, I'm excited to go into stage three. Not so much for the eating part. Like, you know. But for the... I have gotten a whole bunch of, like, recipes from Tamika's channel, Anumi 1109. She's great, soul inspiration, and her recipes look yum. So I'm totally looking forward to that and to see how I can do it. So anyway, um, if I remember anything else, I will come back and make a video. I feel like if I if I start feeling like I want to be lingering around and looking for some food, I think I'm going to make a video instead so I can get my mind off of the food. Uh, but yeah, that's it. And I hope you guys didn't get too bored with my video. Um, and I will see you soon because I love watching your guys' videos. And if you haven't made one yet and you're only watching videos, make them because it's the best accountability. And it's the best support. I love having the YouTube and Facebook community to go to. So, alright. Thanks, guys. Bye.